Apparently there's a way to turn on the crosshair for while you're using the bow and arrow. I have to do it in the uh, in the console as a console command, but I haven't I don't know if I should do it or not. I kind of like that the bow and arrow is super hardcore and the fact that you don't have a cursor and it's kind of hard to aim it, but then again, it's kind of silly and then there's a lot of RNG. So a part of me wants to put the cursor up so I don't waste arrows. The funny thing is that it's true. Wait, are you serious? Doritos are really called Cool American? No way. You guys gotta be trolling with me, man. There's no way that's real. Hello, sir. Who are you? I wish I could talk to them while on the... Okay. Just a random guy, man. He, he was in the wrong place at the wrong time. Put this man in the bush. He has a scarf. I'm gonna take the coin. Thank you. I had to. I had to, I'm a loot goblin. When in doubt, knock a motherfucker out and take his goddamn coin. His going. Not his coin, his going. Honey, I'm home. <clears throat> My voice cracked like seven times right there. Honey. Uh, Captain Bernard, I'm here to talk to you, sir. Well, well. Look who deigns to grace us with his presence. Bernard, I've been working. I was looking for that boy and... And you didn't bother telling anyone. I had to follow the trail before it went cold. And what if some bandit skewered you and left you for dead? We'd never find you because you told no one where you were going. How would I explain that to Sir Radzig, eh? I really don't know, my lord. He disappeared without saying a word to anyone. Never crossed my mind he wanted to get himself killed. Bernard, shut I, up! I did all the work! I... Silence! Keep your ignorant mouth shut when I'm giving you the benefit of a veteran's wisdom. You do what I tell you, answer only when I ask, and not go roaming off whenever you feel like it. I'd like to kick your arse back to the castle and be shut of you. Sheesh. But it's true, you're a fucking peasant who knows nothing about soldiering, and it's my job to whip you into shape. So I'm not done with you yet. God have mercy on you if you ever try anything like that again. I'll be with you, Henry. If you're lucky, I'll only have you whipped and clapped in the stocks. Because if I get my way, you'll be hanged for desertion. Jesus. I hope we've got that out of the way. And I've made myself absolutely clear. And now, let's hear what you have to report. Wow. I talked to Ginger and found out what happened. Out with it, then. Ginger fled because he recognized one of the raiders. He was afraid they'd come back to silence him. Well, he was right. They were asking about him. So who did he recognize? He didn't know his name. Some fellow with a limp from Ujits. All right. Since you've gone this far, you may as well ask around in Ujits. We have enough to do here in these parts anyway. Sir Radzik will tell you about it. He said to send you to him if you haven't already been. All right. Training. Uh, sword. I'd like to improve my swordsmanship. Certainly. Beginner slightly advanced requires level of... Uh... I'm interested in more advanced techniques. Wouldn't you rather learn the basics first? I thought I have learned the basics. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. 60 gold? Isn't that quite a lot? How about 55? Since it's you... A little more, and we'll call it a deal. No, no, a little more. <sighs> Fine. Agreed. Now, listen up. I'll do it. You improved sword. Well, I mean, I I'll guess I'm not you. spending my gold on anything else. I might as well. 
Can you teach me how to defend myself better in combat? Certainly. I'm interested in more advanced techniques. Wouldn't you rather learn the base? I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll... It can cost me 60 gold every time. I don't know if it's worth doing this. Maybe another time. I'd like to learn to fight better with an axe. No, certainly. I don't, I don't actually want to learn to fight better with an axe. I don't even use an axe. Well, I'll think it over. So when do I? Okay, hang on. Let's see. Player combat. Level two is my defense. Progress 73%. Increases the time you can hold a perfect block or dodge, as well as increasing the defense state of weapons and shields. New perk points unlock at levels 4, 8, 12, 16, and 20. You've learned to fend off the opponent's blow with a well-timed block. You'll know exactly when to block from the appearance of a green shield in the middle of the combat rows. This block costs you no stamina. If, while executing the perfect block, you also hit the strike button, you'll execute an immediate... Rip, riposte. I don't know. I don't know what that is. Repo, repost, repost. Your opponent can only defend against a repost by means of perfect block, and you can also use the same defense if the tables are turned. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So I have to hit perfect block and the strike button at the same time to execute it, and it can only be blocked with a perfect block. That's what I need to do. It's just not worth it. New perk points unlock at levels 3, 5, and 8. So did I use a perk point? Oh, I do have this. Slash, slash, stab. With a rapid Zornhoff from Ox stance, parry the opponent's strike to the side from your left shoulder and thrust the point straight to his chest. But that's with only a longsword, which I am currently assuming not using. This is a short sword. Of course it is. Of course it is. Anything for a short sword? These are all short sword stuff. Stab slash slash short sword. Hmm. So these are the other. These are all the moves you can get. Okay. I feel. Oh my god! I would love to have better defense. I don't have a shield. Be a bit more careful. Yeah, yeah. Be more careful. Eat my butt, dude. Let's see. Uh, quest log. Go back to Ginger's Guardians. I already did that optional. I have to ask if Neo said for him if Ginger can go back and report the progress of the investigation to Sir Radzig. Which I did. Oh, no. Sir Radzig. I haven't done that. We got to go ask if he's allowed to come back. Right? Oh. This is the spot. Hello. Oh, there's Sir Radzig. R Radzig is here? I thought Radzig was Greetings. back in the castle. What do you need? That moly, 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 moly. My lord, I managed to find a clue to the whereabouts of the bandits. Excellent. Bernard already told me what's been happening, but I'd like to hear it straight from the horse's mouth. The whole story or just the gist of it, sir? It's up to you what you consider important. Report the progress of the investigation. In brief, then, the whole story. I mean... In brief. Well, in the end, I tracked down the stable boy who fled in fear of his life. And for good reason, too. He put me on the trail of a crofter from Ujit with a limp. And his name? But the boy didn't know him by name, only by sight. But if I ask around, I'm sure folk will know who limps and keeps peculiar company. Villagers like to gossip. But what if he's not there? He could have fled, maybe even to Kuttenberg. If I don't find him in Ujit, so I'll ask around. Someone will know something about him. All right. Better go to Ujits then. Find this limping footpad and get the names of the others out of him. They have to face justice for what they did. I want to see them hang. Then bring him to me in Merhoyed and I'll decide on his fate. Certainly, sir. Oh, objective failed. Go back to Ginger's Guardians. Okay. Well, game saved. Find the new half bandit in. Yushuits. Yushuits. How far away is that? How far? Holy shit. You gotta go. No. 
where are we going? Find the nightingales. Trap set. Kill the camp leader. Where is the other mission? A bit more careful. That's why. Oh, there it is. Okay. We're fast traveling all the way over here. All the way. Wayfair? What does that mean? Ignore, examine, examine. Success. Quest started. Mysterious ways. I'll ride my horse. If I must. Alright. Well, I'm going all the way. We'll just ride our goddamn horse all the way. Directly north, essentially. Sweet! Pretty sure we've been through here already. Run, deer, before I shoot you in the face! Your stupid frickin' face! Sometimes you gotta kill deer, okay? Sometimes you gotta put Bambi's motherfucking mama down. You gotta feed your kids, you know? Gotta feed the entire village. Are these the... Hello, sirs? I'm gonna just ride past you. It's just beautiful out here for a man like me. Now, who, li who lives here? Because I, uh... I need some friends. It's been a while since I've been in the, the comfort of a, of a nice woman. Hello? What the hell is this place? I'll take a torch, that's it. I've reached a new level in lock picking. I've gotten a lot better at lock picking, or they made it a lot easier. <gasps> There's a person right there. Is someone's bedroom? There we go. Ooh, oh, we got some dresses, some nightgowns, working garment. I mean, I'm in her clothing and I feel bad. Riding boots? I'm not actually going to take any of that. I don't want to steal. What do you got? Beat, you got a bunch of food. I want to, but I shouldn't. No, I can't. I can't steal from this lady. I don't know who she is. We're just going to leave feel bad. She's a nice young woman. She lives out here on her own. Probably just, you know, she's a farmhand. I wonder Go what Teresa's doing now. Oh. I could stop by and see her again. I enjoyed it last time. Yeah, we did. Okay. 
Can I bathe in this really quick? Can. I'm gonna wash myself. Alright. Not bad. We just gotta keep going along this road north. Oh! Thank God that doesn't do any damage to me. <laughs> Can you guys imagine if it if it like did half your health every time you fell off your horse? Cause that would really suck. Okay, we all good. Ooh, that's a cool little pond. Look at the giant lily pads. I wish I could actually go inside the pond without like drowning. Oh wait. the hell? It won't let you do that in, in the other water. Ah, beautiful day for a swim in the pond. Dude, someone took a poop right there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a dead lady right here. God, what the fuck happened? I hear somebody. What are you doing, you murderer? I didn't murder this lady! I didn't kill anyone. The corpse was already lying there when I got here. I saw you robbing the corpse. Oh, I, I mean, I was examining the crime scene. I was finding out what happened here, so I could report it. Hmm. All right. All right. I suppose you're not the guilty one after all. I'm glad you saw sense. And what are and what you exactly doing here? What exactly were you doing here, anyway? What are you getting at? Are you the killer? Let's see. Hmm. Admit it, it would be easier. It'll be easier for you if you confess. All right, then. I did it. I knew you did! I didn't want to kill her. I just wanted to have a bit of fun. Then she pulled a knife on me. I took it off her. And this is how it ended. You don't have to tell anyone, you know. And... And you won't regret it. Alright, pay up and you can go. I won't be bribed. I don't want anything from you. Go. Alright, pay up. <laughs> Good doing business with you, you fucking freak. Alright, but we're gonna do something. I'm not letting this guy go. Thanks for the money, dickweed. I knew it was sketch when this guy popped up as soon as I saw a body. Take all the rest of your coin. Uh, Knight's hunting sword. Take that. I'm gonna take all this. I'm over encumbered. Let's see. I mean, yes, I stole, but who cares? Stolen in God knows where. I mean, is it really stealing if it's from a, a murderer? Like, come on. Seems hardly like stealing. Also, he's not dead, right? We didn't kill him, no. Guys, he's not hes not dead, but we're gonna do something. <laughs> Maybe he likes going in the, uh, in the pond. <laughs> oh shit, that's so messed up. I'm gonna put her body there too. Stinky little bitch, belongs not her, but him. He, he deserves... He belongs there. He's not even dead. He's just unconscious. I wonder if he'll die. I wonder if he'll drown. Ooh, what the hell? Um... He's floating. I mean, he's not gonna die. He's floating. Alright. <laughs> you guys think he drowned? No, he's still alive.
Oh no, I hear I hear somebody coming. There you go. He floats to the top. Look, he's got two heads though. Shit's weird. Shit's really weird. Find out where the limping bandit lives. Ooh, a bunch of horses right here. This must be a stable. You discovered a shrine. Now... We gotta find out where this limping bastard lives. He, he lived... Doesn't he live in a... He said he lived on the outside, the outskirts of the town. Hello! Hello, madam. Who are you? I want to know about this town. The fellow with the limp. I'm looking for a fellow who lives here, but I don't know his name. Do you know anyone with a limp? I. He lives here all right. The devil take him. In a cottage at the end of the village by the road to Neuhof. Okay, thank you. First person I ask knows. So where at exactly? L Lubash. His name is Lubash. Oh, he close, boys. He real close. Let's go. Let's go bathe really quick again before we. Uh, we got to make sure we look good. Visit Lubash. What is this? The butcher. Let's see. Locations. Butcher. The butcher's profession, but what can we do with the butcher? Inside the butcher's guild, a split into different specializations, such as those who work with only a lard and soup. Eh, I don't need the actual definition. I just wanted to know what I can use the butcher for. Hello? Oh, here's the butcher. Jesus Christ be praised. Can I trade them my meats? I can sell. What if I like? Hmm. I'm gonna sell this. I can sell all my meats. Trader's wealth 200. Your reputation. Uh, you get 51 gold. Uh, check basket. Close the deal. Yeah, dude. Thanks, man. Actually, what did what did they trade? Or what did they sell? Just meat. Bacon, beef, boar meat, chicken, cooked hair meat, hair meat. So raw hair meat too. Smoked sausage, salami. I like how it, it takes away energy when you eat meat. So you get the meat sweats. You get the meat sweats. You, shop guard. Okay, I don't wanna. Is this all of the butcher shit? I I, I don't want any beef. Get it? No, bad bad joke. No, I can't do that, man. He he. Oh. What the hell? There was a there was a huge crowd outside this dude's house. Move along, citizens. Move along. There's nothing to see here. That's what you call nothing to see. I'd like to know what something to see looks like. Good one. By the keys of St. Peter, this is all I need. We'll have to send word to Sir Hanush. That might not be necessary. Who are you? I'm Henry of Scalitz, in the service of Hanush's Captain Bernard. I'm investigating the attack at Neuhof, and I think this could be related. Well, I'm the bailiff of Auschwitz. And I say, we don't want any of that kind of trouble around here. What makes you think this has anything to do with Neuhof? One of the folk at the stud farm recognized someone from Auschwitz among the bandits. We have no bandits or murderers around here. Really? They say he had a limp? Shit. Well, allow me to introduce you to Limpy Lubosch. Or all that's left of him. It's just 
took an unexpected turn? <sighs> Nothing's ever easy. I'll have to take a look around and ask a few more questions, if that's all right with you. You can take this mess off my hands and welcome to it. As for what else there is to find out, I don't know. But look and ask all you like. Well, at least they're not, you know, trying to make it difficult on me. At least they're trying to help me out. Ninja Nacho, thank you for that tier 3 58 months, bro. Ninja, you're crazy, bro. So thank you for your continued support, my man. I really appreciate that. Who was Limpy Who was Limpy Lubosh? Lubosh? Limpy Lubosh. A poor crofter and a scoundrel. Can't say I'm too surprised what happened to him. He kept company with all sorts of vermin. He was always getting into some kind of trouble. Punch-ups in the tavern and what have you. Hey, Henry's come to see us. How come he limped? He got that from some villainy or brawl a long time ago. Has he been up to anything suspicious lately? Hmm. I don't know. The last few days he didn't go anywhere. He was home the whole time. But he always kept everyone in the village how at arm's you, length. Stop saying how are you, Henry? You don't even know who I am. Did he have any kith or kin in the village? None. A loner he was. I don't know the last time I saw him with anyone. Do you happen to know where he was on the night of the Neuhof raid? I've no idea. He kept his distance from other folk, so you never knew if he was away or holed up at home. Hmm. When did you find the body? And did anyone see anything? Just now. And nobody saw or heard anything. I don't know how they could gut him like that without someone hearing him scream. Hmm. Another thing about Lou, boss. All right, that's it. Thank you for the help, Bailiff. What about you, villager? Do you have anything? I've come in the name of Sahanish of Leiper. I'm investigating the massacre in Neuhof, and now a murder here as well. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask away. Hey, who was Henry's this Lubos who was us. murdered? He was a drunkard and a beast, and lazy too. Idle hands are the devil's tools. Have you noticed anything suspicious recently? The only thing seemed suspicious was how a rogue like him suddenly started going to church. Now I see why, of course. Do you know what Lubosch was doing the day Neuhoff was raided? What do I care about that scoundrel? I was glad he stayed out of my way. Do you know who Lubosch used to spend time with? Kin or friends? He was always a loner. Except lately he started talking to the parish priest of all people. Uh, That's all. The parish priest. God bless. God bless. My respects to you. Can you tell me anything? I'll come in the name of Sir Han Of course. I'm assuming it's the same answer. That man Lubos. He was a drunk who was. Have you noticed anything? Well, now I think of it, I haven't seen him around for a while. No idea where he was skulking. Hmm. Do you know anyone Lubos used to... He was a loner. Do you know what Lub... Not a clue. Okay, you're That's useless. All. Thank you so much. All right. Innkeeper, head groom. Head groom. Good day to you. Any work going here? Enough for a dozen men. You could take the place of that useless stable hand, Vashek, but I start. What happened? Did he do something wrong? just found out that he lost our pie. Lost it where? In his stomach? A pie? No, no. Pie was our fastest stallion. A lovely dappled one. Oh. Well, that's bad news. How did Vashek manage to lose him? He fell, banged his head, and the horse bolted. Can you fathom it? A stable hand falling <laughs> off a horse. And then Pie took off at a gallop. Oh, shit, we gotta get Pie back. Well, I can't take Vashek's job, but I can try to find your pie. That would be nice of you. If there's anything you need to know, ask that fool. I was too livid to even speak to him. Right. I hate when I lose my pie in my stomach. The horse that bolted. A quest started. Jesus Find Christ pie. be praised. Alright. Are you got... Uh, Yosef. Yosef. 
Good health to you. Good, good health, Yosef. I've come in the name of Sir Hannah. I don't know nothing about it, but... You don't know anything, That man eh? Lubos who was... I didn't really know him. Hmm. Have you noticed anything since... Oh, come to think of it, he was in church. He was in I church. was wondering what he was up to, to take to the faith all of a sudden. They're gonna say the anyone? same thing about the priest. Do you know what Lubos was doing? He looked... Alright, to That's the all. priest we go. Thank you. What archery the master. Oh, you can... Can you train me in some archery shit? Good day to you. Nope, you can't. Okay, well, fuck me, man. Trader Marush, Marush, what up, Marush? All right, that must be that must be probably everything. Okay. So let's see, map, quest tipster. Wait, who's the quest tipster right here? I talked to all of them. Okay, not all of them, I suppose. God be with you. God be with you, sir. Ah. Is there anything Henry's suspicious going on in these parts? Indeed, there is. Uh, just last night, Father Godwin was here, calling fire and brimstone down on old Gertrude, the herb woman. He's not one to make a fuss over some trifle either. Is there anything suspicious going on in these? Nothing out of the. All right. Well, thanks. I guess. Uh, well, uh, find out more about Limpy. Uh, talk to the priest. I guess we're going into the town. Well, shit, man. We... Wait, can we go back into his house, maybe? I didn't even try to go back in. What's this? Looks like someone's hit him very hard on the head. Could they have bludgeoned him to death and then gutted him? Would explain what an inscription in blood. Pity I don't know how to read. Looks like they wanted to give someone a warning, but who? And a bandit who knows how to write isn't something you see every day. Hmm, interesting. Lord of birth, they did a hell of a job on him. Must have been agony. How come no one heard anything? Armor. Well, it seems Lubos wasn't your everyday crofter. And judging by the bloodstains, it looks like he lived the way he died. Lord above, they did a hell of a job on him. Yeah, they Must did. have been agony. How come no one heard anything? Hmm. Well. He definitely doesn't need anything that's left in the house, does he? <laughs> Is he dead as hell? Picking is increasing tenfold. Bandages dog skin pelt from a dog. Other. I guess move to horse. Oops. Horse hide, move to horse, cow hide, red deer hide. Dog skins. Small armorer's kit. Is that 49%? The item is too damaged to repair with this kit. Oh. Okay. Well, fine. Fuck me. I don't know what to keep and what not to keep. Still considered stealing, even though he's dead. Cheese, bread. I don't want to do that. Can we go up there? No? Okay. We're going to leave this guy's house. Alright. Let's go find out what the hell happened to Limpy. I kind of like this town. It's a little bit more spaced out. A little hilly. Hello, sir. Do you have any info for me? Good day to you. What do you do? Uh, apparently nothing, chubby fuck. 
How about you, sir? What are you doing? Be a bit more careful. You be a bit more careful. Who's there? It's me. It is I, you're who you're looking for. Excuse me, what are you guys doing here? You guys hoeing? Just a bunch of hoers? What's that? Hello, I'm friendly, man. Don't worry about me. steal anything. I'm just opening it. I, trust me, I want to steal all that. I really... Oh, hello! Um... What? Oh, Yosef. Uh, you were the guy I was talking to earlier. I've come in the name of... I don't know nothing about... Well, That's what all. the... You're no, you. you're no use to me, then. You're, you're no use. Hello, puppy. Dude, is that your shit pile? You discovered a fast travel point. Who's this guy? Why is he running at me? The bastard! <laughs> is that Who are you? Stop him, someone! Stop that guy? I'll go tackle him. Hey, come back here, you thief! Fucker. Come on. Yeah, get him, bud. I got your back. Are you going to cry now? You done? You done fighting now, aren't you? That's what I thought. Had enough. Yeah, yeah, you got me. For the love of God, I only stole a piece of bread. I was starving. Be glad it didn't end up worse. Keep it and run. You'll die for that. No excuses. Hand it over. Here. You got the thrashing you deserved. I hope you've learned your lesson. Yes, sir. I got you your bread really back. let him go? Just like that? And did you get the loot back? Yes, I got your loot back. I did. I have it here. Thank you, the thieving magpie. You can't trust anyone these days. <clears throat> and just so you know, I'm no pinch purse. Here's a small reward. Sweet. Thanks. Thanks, man. What the hell? I helped you, man. I just helped you. Dramatically. I'm just a nice guy doing my part here in the world. I mean, I am in a part of a new city. I'm here to, who are you? Who, who are you? I've talked to you earlier. It's the same people. I've come in the name of Sah. I don't know. Do you, you got, know who Lubot? You got nothing? As far as I know. All right, she's That's got all. nothing. You'd be a bit more careful. over here hello chickens can't go in there oh what the fuck A little cellar hello what in the it's fine it's fine it's all good I want to find out more about what's his name but Nobody else to talk to. Hmm. What's going on there? What in the? Who's there? Nothing's Anthony. going on. It's okay. You three. Hey, puppy. <laughs> Bad 
baker lives here. Maybe the baker knows something. People gotta buy stuff from the baker, right? God be with you. Hello, Mr. Baker, sir. I've come in the name of Sahan. I don't know nothing. Fine. That's all. Sell. Hmm. I mean, I don't know. Sell my apples. What did I just do? Oh, no, no. That's fine. Close the deal. Thank you. Oh, I'm trespassing. I'm sorry, sir. That was an accident. I had no idea that was off limits in there. Yikes. Yeah, I know we can talk to the priest. I was there I was hoping to talk to someone else before the priest, but that's alright. To the priest we'll go. Yo, priest! Where the hell you at, bitch? This is a weird looking church. You're, this is a private area? Is that church broken or something? Oh, here's the priest. Maybe. Father Go Godwin. You know how to wield a sword. I see you know how to wield a sword, Father. I wouldn't have expected that from a man of the cloth. With a stick. I practice with a stick. A reminder of my youth and days gone by. And it helps keep me in good form. All right, fair enough. The blessings of our good Lord be with you, Father. I'm here in the name of Sahanish of Lypa, investigating the massacre at Neuhof, which seems to be connected to a murder here. Can I ask you a few questions? It seems Sir Hanush is employing children as investigators. But ask as you wish, boy. Bitch, I am I not a boy! Nasty business will be cleared I'm a grown-ass man! Did you know Lubosh? What was he like? A bit of a lost soul. Simple, rough fellow, but at heart I don't think he was such a bad person. Hmm. Did you notice anything suspicious recently? My child. All sorts of suspicious things have been going on recently. People like Lubos don't know what to do about it, and sometimes they do stupid things. That's really not a lot of help to me, Father. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> do you know what Lubos was doing on the day Neuhoff was raided? Unfortunately, I do know. And I'd like to help you with your investigation, but I can't. What? What? I'm bound by certain vows that forbid me to tell you. Vows more important than catching dangerous murderers? There are laws of God above the laws of man, son. And one of those is the sanctity of the confessional. Oh, God. Father, surely you can't be serious. There must be situations in which you can make an exception. There are things that apply always, no matter what the circumstances. And this is one of them. Hmm, you can't hurt him now. You could be condemning innocent people to death. I'll get the confession out of you by force, Jesus. But Lubosh is dead. You can't hurt him. But if you don't tell me, more innocent people may die. If I told you I would be betraying a vow that's a cornerstone of the Holy Church, if people believed the sanctity of the confessional couldn't be trusted, the consequences would be even worse than that. Worse than the death of innocent Christians? Worse than the murderer escaping punishment? No one escapes punishment. Oh, dear Christ. Father, Lubosh was my only lead to the Neuhof Raiders. Only he could tell me who was responsible for that massacre. If I don't find out who it was, it will probably happen again. Surely you wouldn't want that. I wouldn't. But I can't betray the sanctity of the confessional. I'll tell you what. Give me some time and I'll try to think up some way of helping you. Suppose we talk it over in the evening. In the tavern. Over a cup of good wine. Maybe we'll come up with something. All right. Thank you, Father. Damn it, man, I couldn't get him to convince, or I couldn't convince him to tell me. Shit, I'm gonna wash myself again. Gotta stay clean. All right. Well, meet the parish priest in the tavern in the evening. Oh, I kinda wanna explore the city a little bit more. Since we have a little bit of time anyway, right? What is considered the evening? After 5 p.m.? 
I'm assuming, like, it's gotta be the evening. It's already the evening. You discovered a scribe. Hey, teach me how to read. Good day to you. I'd like to learn to read. I'd like to learn to read. You? Hmm. You don't look like the makings of a priest or clerk. But why not? I've taught all sorts. Bear in mind, it won't be all that easy. You'll need plenty of time and a few groschen for my trouble. We can get all started. Right. I don't want to waste time. We can get started. The sooner I master it, the better. Very well. I will require some groschen from you, though. And set aside at least a couple of days so I can put you through your paces. If indeed time is of the essence. Here are your Grushin. Then we may as well start. He did break his vow. But better than to dishonor Hopefully his this team. doesn't mess up my other mission and I miss the done. the appointment I have with the priest. That would suck. He did say he needed a couple days. Wake up, lad. It's time we were getting on. <sighs> so, let's see you read a bit. Objective started. Read the book. There's a book here on the table. Try to read it. Will I manage? You ought to be able to. It's a simple text. Come back once you've worked your way through it. Did it. I've read the book. Wonderful. So tell me, what have you learned? Uh. That being greedy doesn't pay. That being greedy doesn't pay. Excellent. You're one of my most talented pupils. You've uncovered the meaning hidden in the letters. Like I told you, books are valuable. And the words that you place in them ought to be no less so. Does that mean that I can read then? Yes, you have the foundation. Remember, my boy, the pen is mightier than the sword. To fully learn your way around words will take a lot more reading yet. Now we'll move on to the second lesson, which will be much harder. Many books are written in Latin, the language of erudite and religious men. If you really want to be able to read, there's no getting away from Latin. There's a book on the table with some text. Read it and then come back. You need not understand it, but you should master the letters. I only just managed the fable about the goose, and now you're asking me to tackle Latin. <laughs> you're a clever lad. You'll manage. Sir, I'm not ready for this. Is it this book you want me to read? This is the same one. I thought maybe Damn. the... We good? You good? Bobby, I didn't mean to run into you, sir. Maybe it's this book. Uh... Oh, yeah, I can read that. Easy. I understood it. I read I read the page. the page. So tell me, Distrupule, what's written there? I have a 33% chance to guess right. Dullest liver, liquor party profit. I don't think that's it, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Uh, dullest liver, the ta tam malus, uh, at non uh, liquor party profit. Not bad, my boy. Good effort. You're almost there, but you better go back and read it again. All right, all right. I'm reading the Latin text again. I'm reading it. He's really judging me. Null su es ibre tam malsu et non prosit libri mote mutai im gistri snut. I have no idea. I haven't a clue. I read the page. So tell me. Uh, this one. 
Nullus est liber tam. Good heavens! Don't tell me you haven't had lessons before. I'm a genius! Excellent! Well, there's nothing more I can teach you. Congratulations! You can go and be ordained right away. Thank you, Domine. I'm feeling a lot Who the fuck uh, is the guy in the background? Where did you come from, you weirdo? You've reached a new level in reading. Yes! Sweet. And strength, I got a point as well. Oh, tight grip. Your stamina regeneration will not slow down in combat, even on the weapon backswing. Oh. You can deplete an opponent's health stamina by bumping into him at a sprint. The effect is increased if your armor is heavier than his. You can carry 15 pounds more. Carrying dead or unconscious buddies won't cost you any stamina, and they will, and they will burden you only half as much. Hmm. What do I want to do? Uh, I'm going to do this one. I'm going to do tight grip. Thank you. Skills. Reading. All books are cheaper. When reading, you will get tired and hungry twice as slowly as normal. Let's do that. In the flow. In the flow. Mightier than the sword. A quest completed. Yes. Okay. Quest logs. The horse that bolted fine pie. Go and see. Oh, yeah. That's right. We can go see our lady. Ooh, we could go get it. I kind of want to. I feel like we should. You cannot fast travel from this location. Okay. Now, what am I doing? We got to go talk to the priest first. 